Good morning, guys. Yeah, so Robbie Valentine is hosting another summer basketball camp for kids this summer, starting June 7th through July. He's really excited. He's actually got some girls who have taken his camp before. Here this morning, Robbie, you're working on free throws, and I hear that that's what wins ball games. Most definitely. And you can't, you can't not shoot enough. I mean, you got to shoot hundreds of free throws every day. And uh, I think it's very, very important that, that the kids focus on this area, too, because you have some of the best basketball players in the NBA. And the thing is, they can't shoot from the perimeter. They can't shoot from the free throw line. But this right here are game winners. And, uh, you know, just it, you got to focus. And, and uh, you know, we want the kids to shoot free throws when they're tired. Because yeah. at the end of the game, you shoot more. Ten, you tend to shoot more free throws at the end of the game, and you do it when you're tired. So as they work out and they go through some hard drills, you have everybody shoot about 50, you know, anywhere between 25 and 50 free throws per, per, per player. And you're excited to welcome different ages of kids to your camps. It's all about learning these techniques, these tips, gaining confidence and having fun. I know you're planning on doing something special for some kids whose parents might not uh, can afford these camps. Yeah, we're going to do uh, a, a couple weeks of uh, uh, camps at no cost to the kids in the community, uh, most definitely in Louisville and in the Radcliffe area where I'm from. And, and uh, thank God for uh, Commonwealth Credit Union and Pepsi and Alice Houston and Junior Bridgman and and it's uh, great to have people in our community will step up and and make sure these kids have the same opportunities as the other kids. All right. Well, while you work with these girls, I'm actually going to steal you over here, Kylie. So listen, you have actually done these camps since you were a little girl. Now you are a sophomore and you're a staff member. What what did you gain as a kid from doing these camps? Um, obviously, you know, you learn obvious basketball skills, but I've also learned, you know, be a better leader, be a better person, you know, because it teaches you just life skills and stuff like that in general. You're returning as a staff member this year. I know that you kind of wanted to do the camp, but what are you excited about most working with kids who were doing the camp? Yeah, I was a little upset I couldn't play this year. You know, it's kind of crazy transitioning over, but you know, I want to give the, that opportunity to the kids that like I had, you know, be that, you know, strong camp leader that everyone, you know, looks up to and give them, you know, basketball and life lessons.